Hey guys and welcome to the highest ergo build for the MP153 shotgun. This is going to be based off the one that you get from tier 2 Jaeger for 28k. As we're on Jaeger we need to head over to tier 3. We need to get ourselves the stock adapter tactical Tallulah for the MP133 slash 135. As well as the 610mm battle for the MP153. We then need to head over to Skia. We need to go to tier 2 and get ourselves the Remington Tactical Choke 12 gauge. We then need to head over to tier 3. We need to grab ourselves the Fab Defense Buffer Tube for the AGR870. We then need to head over to tier 4 and grab ourselves the Fab Defense AGR870 Pistol Grip. We now need to head over to Peacekeeper, need to go to tier 3 and grab ourselves the Magpul PRS Gen 3 stock. This is everything you need for the build. And this is the highest ergo build for the MP153 shotgun. If you would like to mount a sight on the front of the shotgun, or on the shotgun in general, you need to go to tier 2 and get yourselves the Kiba Arms International SPRM mount. Bear in mind, this will increase the ergo. You might be wondering why you'd want on a high ergo build. Long story short, there's a lot of tasks coming up where you're going to actually need shotguns. And recoil isn't the best thing for shotguns. If you want to ADS decently quick, if you're using slugs, you kind of want to use a high ergo build. So, I know we come here to test the recoil, but let's actually give it a go. Also, because you got a decently high ergo, even standing whilst holding your breath, you will not lower down your stamina bar. But, we've only got 5 shots, so let's go. That was clicking as fast as I could as well. And as you can see, all of those 5 shots were actually together, which is really nice. Let's go for long distance. I am clicking as fast as I can. But that is extremely consistent, actually. I wonder how the accuracy works at distance with the PK-06. Okay, so it shoots a little low. Try that again. Yeah, so it does shoot low. Bear in mind, sights on shotguns don't really work that well. Um, but hopefully, this should get you a decent amount of kills with the quick snap into heads. I prefer to ADS, not gonna lie, when you blind fire. With shotguns, sometimes they can be quite unpredictable. I might just be bad. But guys, thank you very much for watching. Hopefully this gun is going to help you out in some tasks, especially as it's semi-auto. Guys, have a good one, and I'll see you in the next video.